The funny thing about training employees is that they have to learn as HR directors and training, allegedly, coordinators that don't usually have training backgrounds, is that you can't afford your employees. Now let's think about that. I'm a young entrepreneur and I'm looking at maybe hiring someone, but then I just said, you know what, I'd rather just use my family and friends to volunteer. And in doing so, it allowed me to produce a life for me and my family because I had good relations with my family and friends there. But when you move cities to change your life after the life loss of your life, which is, happens to be your wife, people want to piss all over you if you have no rights to talk about life. We've got young 16 to 18 year old white men and black men who think they're men. And I look at them and going, okay, I can see what's in your package because your britches are under your ass on both sides of yourself. And I think, wow, look how you're representing yourself. And maybe you're a major player in Hollywood where you can dress that hip-hop kind of rock star way, but in America, most of those people never make it today. The liar is you're trying to produce yourself as a badass, and that's great. But most communities don't need badasses in their communities. They need young men trying to be great. And a young man trying to be great doesn't try to tell a man who's in his 50s what a loser he is today. What that means is that young man is so out of his bounds in his life that he's been entitled to think by his father, I guarantee his father, his father figure, his grandfather, that he is some sort of thing worth being arrogant. How is that, please? Has he produced a wife? Has he produced a life that really provides for him a true life? Has he produced a vacation? Has he earned a ability to make a woman want him in terms of having a child and paying for that child's life? Putting them through elementary school, junior high school, and college, or some sort of degree? Has that young man at 16 to 18 done anything worthy to support our communities? Has that young man done anything volunteer work? Now, some very well educated, very sound, spiritually sound black women are producing young men like that. That they drag their kids to go do volunteer work, and I'm impressed by that. But I'm not picking on blacks or, or whites. I'm just saying, who are you today? You just put your personal brand out in front of me last night, and then you pissed all over me with police. Or was it a white father of yours who said, go piss on him. Be a man. Tell him what he is. Yeah, I'm a homeless man. Because lying people in my family of origin pissed all over my apartment where I live, stole intellectual property from me, stole information on my car from me, took my keys, ruined my life. If I told you the whole fucking story of what I've been through during the last five to seven to practically 10 years now, you wouldn't fucking believe me. You'd call me the biggest uh, soothsayer, not at all. You'd call me the biggest tall tale, tall tale teller, say that 10 times fast, and you wouldn't believe me. I walk into a church and look for help all during the time when I still had my vehicle, simply saying, this is my book. It's on God. It's not perfect. It's 10 or $20. Would your church be willing to buy a copy of it for your library so I might eat? And you know how many no's I got across Fishers, Indiana? Almost every church I visited. Their young pastor in their 30s said no. Because those were the boys that were hanging out. And you know what they were doing? It was a day I was a starving. They were going off to lunch and they said, I'm sorry, I'm going off to lunch. And I sat there and looked at them and go, okay, you just denied Jesus some food. Isn't that interesting? And you'll say, how rude. It's not rude. You see, in America, we have the right to eat. And some of us have to find our food in different ways. But today, when the rain stops, I'll get off this concrete slab where I've been out of the rain so that I can keep my health, which is one of my life balance things. And I can protect myself which I have the right to do from cold and other things. And I will walk off and get my food for the day by earning every minute of my walk. 